Hi, I was having trouble with my coffee machine here. I took the grinder apart to clean it because it was gummed up with oily coffee residue. Uh, I know not to use oily beans, but the previous owner did not. <clears throat> anyway, the grinder was uh, was completely caked in, in grind, so I had to take it apart to fully clean it. And then after I put it back together, I found that the grinds I was getting were far too coarse and I wasn't able to get the finer grinds. I was setting the, the grind on the smallest one, on one here, but it was still far too coarse. Um, and I couldn't figure out what was going wrong. Um, the adjustment works fine, it goes up and down when there's a bit of pressure on there, it moves up and down as you can kind of see there. Um, I tried all sorts of things, I was trying to unscrew that screw in the middle so it would be not fully screwed down. That would lift that center cone up a little bit and decrease the gap between the two cones inside. Um, but no matter what I was doing, it wasn't working. Um, so I took it apart again because I assumed that I must have put it together incorrectly. And I had, and I figured out that uh, the, the problem is this, this seat here for the top uh, part of the grinder. It's supposed to be locked in place. So right now it's, it's together here, but I can actually just lift this out. And this is where I went wrong. I kind of put this part in last and then I was like okay great that's that's everything done adjustments work fine put the top on but yeah that's not correct now I've found other videos on YouTube kind of showing you how this part comes uh, apart but it doesn't show you how it goes back together again and that's the important part that I missed so if you can take it out at whatever setting it's it's wrong basically you've got to turn this all the way to um, the right so it's like uh, the, the maximum amount of grind. Then take that out and then push it in a bit more. Give it a wiggle. Then turn it to the left. So it's now at the smallest and you'll see that this part is now locked in. It's not coming out anymore. So what's happened here is it's actually kind of like pulled itself down further than it was going before. Before I had it like up here and then kind of in the middle somewhere and then I put this part in it was just sitting on top of the mechanism basically so there was like at least a millimeter or two of, of space between the mechanism where it wasn't like actually pulling it down onto the other part of the grinder it was just sitting on top and that's where that extra gap was coming from and why I wasn't getting the uh, the fine grounds so uh, yeah that's uh, one for anyone else who's experiencing this problem finding that their grinds are too fine after they've disassembled their grinder you got to put it back together in the right way so all the way to the to the right as far as it goes then you kind of take that part put it in and then turn it down and now it's locked in place and it won't come out anymore so that's what you got to do hope this helps someone